All new at 5.30, imposters targeting D-SNAP benefits stopped by a new high-tech security system. Yeah, the state just brought in a high-tech security team to intercept fraudulent attempts to cash in on Florida's food benefits. News 6 investigator Mike Holfeld spoke to the head of the team behind the fraud defense. Whatever the disaster is, these criminals are keyed in on government benefit programs. Haywood Talcove, CEO of LexisNexis Risk Solutions, has devoted the last 14 years to stop national and international imposters from ripping off state and federal benefits programs. What they're doing is they're using your identity and your neighbor's identity to get things that they need. Talco tells News 6 Hurricane Ian's destructive dance across the state has created a potential portal for thieves ready to key in on the state's latest post-storm benefits, the Disaster Supplemental Nutrition Assistance Program, DSNAP. I would suspect there will be more people applying for DSNAP benefits than there are people who actually live in the state of Florida. If he's right, more than 21 million DSNAP applications, most from transnational imposters and gangs, will be filtering into DCF's online data system. It's the Russians, the Chinese, the Nigerians, and the Romanians. They make up 70% of the fraudsters. They use their technology, they use stolen information from the web, and they attack those online services. A LexisNexis study of SNAP programs across the country found every dollar of benefits lost through fraud cost SNAP agencies nearly $4, four times as much. Hi, I'm Siobhan Harris. Something DCF Secretary Harris anticipated, hiring Talcove's company to lead a fraud defense to shut down the con men. We are doing everything we can to ensure you are served. Secretary Harris has done just an amazing job in a short amount of time to make sure that there's no fraud and individuals that deserve their benefits get them quickly. Secretary Harris is urging families to file DSNAP applications by phone. It's safe, secure, and you'll avoid the lines. For more information, go to clickorlando.com. Mike Hofeld, Getting Results, News 6.